Hello and welcome to Food with Life. I am your host, Chapati, and we're here with a very extraordinary guest, uh, Dr. John Bergman, who is the founder of the Bergman Family Chiropractic in Huntington Beach, California. And it's a very unique place um, to go for healing and chiropractic. And uh, I'm going to ask Dr. John Bergman, it's different than other places I have been. And it's very, very you don't just include adjusting here and there, but you include food, you include movement, mm -hmm. exercise, many, many things. So tell me about your vision for chiropractic as opposed to what might be traditional. Um, our, the way we run our clinic is more traditional. In fact, what we do, uh, we focus in that the body is self-healing and self-regulating. Mm -hmm. And there's an innate intelligence inside of the body that expresses itself through environmental stimuli and this is the neat part there's three factors of stress physical chemical and emotional stress and if you deal effectively with all three of those stressors uh, you can reverse uh, about 97 percent of all diseases of those three is usually the physical is the more gross as you say and the emotional more subtle which is probably there's more is there more power in the emotional versus the, the grosser physical or it, it's interesting they all have an equal effect on the body mm. uh, if you're physically stressed from a trauma an accident it has the exact same effect that if you're stressed with um, a, a Carl's Jr. or McDonald's okay or vaccinations mm. or if you're emotionally stressed or your perception of the environment your body is going to have the same um, automatic it's actually through the autonomic nervous system it's going to negatively affect your health and how you express life mm -hmm. and your resistance to disease. So what about, you know, let's say you, you're coming into your office for an adjustment, okay? And many times people are always on this go, 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 hurry, pace fast, fast pace, mm -hmm. here, there. And they're coming in, zoom, they come there, they sit down. Does that, the speed of life, the intensity with which they're going to whatever they might be in the office, at work, just having to be somewhere, does that not affect the adjustments that are given by a chiropractic or no? Uh, and it depends on the perception of that person. There's a tremendous amount of number of high energy people that enjoy that. They thrive on certain stressors. Mm -hmm. It's when the stressors uh, become overwhelming. Mm -hmm. And we all have a balance. And we, we actually live our life through the nervous system. And there's two aspects of the automatic or autonomic nervous system. Sympathetic, which means fight or flight, and parasympathetic, which is the rest, digest, and repair mode. As long as those systems are balanced, mm -hmm. where you can have that incredibly aggressive, high-focused lifestyle, you know, you get up and you run like crazy. If you balance that um, through periods of rest, mm -hmm. then you do have a balanced life and you're going to thrive in this world. Mm. An imbalanced nervous system or an imbalanced perception of the environment because it's not really what's happening it's your perception that radically alters your expression of um, immune system responses and how your body um, deals with life mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the physical chemical and emotional stressors so let's deal with the emotion more you know people many times go through a lot of ups and downs you know happiness joy depression anxiety and so forth. Tell us how chiropractic deals with, let's say, depression. Oh, fantastic. Um, if you look at it through, let's call them stress hormones and feel-good hormones, because emotions are actually chemicals secreted by the brain and your body responds on a cellular basis. So if you're perceiving, like let's say you see a cute little puppy on the ground and you think, oh my God, how cute. Your brain is going to be secreting dopamine, serotonin. You're going to be have have experienced joy. If you think that nasty little ankle biter, you know, scared of little puppies, you're going to be producing um, a, adrenaline, noradrenaline, cortisol, everything. Right. So it's based on your perception of the environment, and then you can actually change that. But there's also a physical representation. Let's say um, there's a trauma that throws the head forward 
that's going to alter dopamine production, which is produced in the brain. Mm -hmm. Let's say that they've had vaccinations or antibiotics, all of which can cause a leaky gut, and that's going to reduce serotonin production. So the physical will absolutely affect the neurologic and the hormone production, which is going to affect um, dopamine, serotonin, and the perception of depression or anxiety. Yeah, I mean, alter all these brain chemicals. Absolutely. And, and that's why um, you can actually rewire the brain. Mm. And a lot of people don't know that you can. I want to talk more about this very important issue. I am your host, Chapati, with our special revered guest, Dr. John Bourbon. We'll be right back. Please stay with us.